Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the question which says that calculate medication dosage by applying ratio and proportion method. Here, doctor's order says that Mr. Tin 4 mg per kg PO that is per OS which means taken by mouth. The patient weighs 110 pounds. Medication label says that Mr. Tin 100 mg per tablet. How many tablets would you administer? Now let us start with the solution of the given question. In this question we have to calculate medication dosage by applying ratio and proportion method. This problem is a three step problem. Firstly we will calculate patient's weight in kilograms as based on the patient's weight in pounds. Also it is given that the patient weighs 110 pounds. Now let x kilograms is equal to 110 pounds. Also we know that 1 kilogram is equal to 2.2 pounds. Now from these two relations we set up an equation as x kilograms is to 110 pounds is equal to 1 kilogram is to 2.2 pounds. Now here we must note that on both sides of this equation kilograms comes first then pounds. This is very important. It doesn't matter which unit comes first as long as they are in the same order on both sides of the equal sign. Now this implies x kilograms upon 110 pounds is equal to 1 kilogram upon 2.2 pounds. Now by cross multiplying we get x kilograms into 2.2 pounds is equal to 1 kilogram into 110 pounds. This implies x is equal to 1 kg into 110 pounds whole upon 2.2 pounds. Now this implies x is equal to now here on solving we get 50 kilograms. So the patient weighs 110 pounds or 50 kilograms. Now in the next step, we will calculate the dose to be administered in terms of milligrams as based on the patient's weight in kilograms. Now we know that Doctor's order says that Mr. Tin, 4 milligrams per kilogram, it means 4 milligrams for 1 kilogram. So we have 1 kilogram is equal to 4 milligrams. Now for patient's weight, that is 50 kilograms, let the dose to be administered be 1 milligrams that is 50 kilograms is equal to Y milligrams. Now from these two relations again we set up an equation as 1 kilogram is to 4 milligrams is equal to 50 kilograms is to Y milligrams. Now again here you can see that on both sides of this equation, kilograms comes first, 
then milligrams. Now this implies 1 kilogram upon 4 milligrams is equal to 50 kilograms upon y milligrams. Now again on cross multiplying we get y milligrams into 1 kilogram is equal to 50 kilograms into 4 milligrams. This implies y is equal to 50 kilograms into 4 milligrams equal upon 1 kilogram which implies y is equal to 50 into 4 milligrams that is 200 milligrams. So for 50 kilograms the dosage is 200 milligrams. Now here the medication label says listed in 100 milligrams per tablet. So in the next step we will calculate that how many tablets should be administered in terms of body weight when each tablet contains 100 milligrams. So here we are given that one tablet is equal to 100 milligrams and we have to calculate that how many tablets will make a dosage of 200 milligrams. Now let Z tablets is equal to 200 milligrams. So here again we set up an equation as One tablet is to 100 milligrams is equal to Z tablets is to 200 milligrams. Now again, here you can see in this equation, tablets comes first, then milligrams. Now this implies one tablet upon 100 milligrams is equal to Z tablets upon 200 milligrams. Now on cross multiplying this implies 1 tablet into 200 milligrams is equal to Z tablets into 100 milligrams. Further, on solving this implies Z is equal to 1 tablet into 200 milligrams whole upon 100 milligrams and on solving this we get Z is equal to 2 tablets. So, you should administer two tablets to the patient. So this is the solution of the given question. That's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.